Justin on your right, and then Bill. Nestor, when they asked you to take the ball in short rest, what type of responsibility were you feeling being tabbed as the starter? Uh, yeah, a lot of pressure, obviously. Um, you know, our, our season was on the line uh, tonight or today. Um, and I knew yesterday when Aaron Boone told me that I, I was starting today, um, he basically told me, you know, give us whatever you got, whether it's one, whether it's three, whether it's five. Um, and uh, I was a little nervous because I knew, you know, the – the fans and everybody was was waiting for for our, our victory. So, um, but definitely, you know, incredible atmosphere, um, incredible feelings. Um, just just happy to be here. What was different with how you were putting hitters away in this game compared to Friday? Um, I thought I induced a lot of weak weak contact uh, today. Um, I wasn't I wasn't trying to strike out the world. I wasn't trying to do anything different. Um, I thought the the cutter was really good early on. Um, I combined that with the heater. Uh, that combo was was effective today, um, and like I said, I induced a lot of soft contact, and that's that's the way that you know things went today. Uh, Bill seated on your right. What was your reaction, the team reaction, when Gene Carlo hit that three run homer? Uh, incredible! I knew, I knew from that moment on, all I had to do was throw strikes and you know be able to get us as as deep as possible. Um, like I said, I didn't know how far I was gonna go. I don't know what my pitch count was. It was basically how how it how I looked out there, um, and for him to give us that that three run lead, you know, in the first from the get go, uh, was huge for me, and it kind of you know calmed me down to just go out there and do what I do. Could you talk about what makes him do so well in the postseason? He has eleven home runs. What, what makes him, you know, shine? Uh, he cares. He cares a lot. Uh, before this series even started, uh, you know, his this guy is just you know his. He doesn't speak very much during the season, but you know when he when he addresses the team and when he comes out and and uh, speaks, you know everybody listens to him because uh, obviously he cares. He's he's been an MVP. He's he's done it all, you know. Um, and I think uh, he's missing a World Series uh, ring. So when it comes down to these moments, he's you know he's hands on with everybody. He's he's giving us uh, everything he has, and and we appreciate everything he does. Uh, the third Thank row in your left, Nestor. Nestor, how does it feel to come up so big in such a big game? Uh, feels incredible. Feels incredible to to be able to to, to do what I did today. Um, like I said, I didn't know how how, how long I was gonna go out there. Um, I was just trying to give my team quality innings, um, whether it was two, three, four innings, five innings, um, and it feels great to to come on top and 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 lead the team to to the CS. Uh, Ron, right up front. What was the situation yesterday when Aaron told you you were starting today? Was it during the rain delay? He called you into the office, walked up to your stall. Uh, yeah, we were waiting. <clears throat> we were waiting um, the whole night. Uh, I remember him saying like, "Hey, we, we might play, you know, eight fifty, and then started to nine thirty, and then you know, nine forty-five, and um, one thing led to the other. And as soon as they 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 banged the game, um, he called me into his office and said, "Hey, uh, we're gonna talk a little bit uh, in between us, and I'll let you know." And, um, you know, maybe like five or ten minutes later, he he came up to me and, you know, kind of gave me like a high five and said, you got it. So I knew from that that, that moment on um, it was game time and I had to do everything to uh, to get ready for, for today. So you were over by your locker when he gave you the high five? I was actually in the training room uh, okay. trying to trying to get treatments done because I was available for yesterday if, you know, things got, you know, a little out of hand. But um, I was in the training room trying to get ready for today. Um, and he came up to the training room and told me what uh, – what I needed to hear. Thank you. Uh, back center, Bruce. Nestor, do you think that your fight in that in that third inning reflects on this ball club and the way that you guys battle as a group and continue to move forward? Yeah, we we've 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 had you know talks in in that clubhouse that we're family. No matter how how bad things can go or how good things can go, uh, we gotta we gotta stay level headed and uh, we gotta compete. We're 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 the only. We got ourselves, you know, we don't have anybody else to, to lean on. So uh, for us to, to battle the way we did, um, you know, going down two games in the series and uh, Garrett Cole having that incredible uh, performance in game four, um, it kind of lit a fire, up, you know, in me. Um, this, guy's, this guy's the ace, you know, we, we, we thrive off him. And for him to do that game four, it just, you know, left all the chips on the table for us to, to, to do what we had to do today. Uh, second row on your right, Justin. Esther, what are players on the team saying about having another opportunity to face and potentially beat the Astros? Yeah, we're excited. Uh, 
you know, everybody knows, we know, the whole world knows what kind of uh, Astros uh, team they are. You know, they they run well, they hit well, they 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 pitch well. You know, they're they're a complete team. Um, and I and I like to say that we are too. So it's gonna be it's gonna be a battle between us too. Um, you know, we're we're going over there tonight. You know, they've been in a couple of days rest, but that doesn't that doesn't mean anything. Um, we go out there tomorrow, uh, just like we have been doing this whole season and these five games, uh, battling every inning, trying to win every inning, um, and let the best you know the the best team win. Uh, standing on your right, Joel. Pretty much everyone says they want the big moment, and not everybody can handle the big moment. Uh, why do you want the big moment, and why do you think you can handle the big moment? I got nothing to lose. Um, I've been I've been in the gutter before. I've been uh, I've been down. So for me, this is just a cherry on the top, you know. And hopefully, there's more moments like this. Um, I feel like today I I came in with the responsibility, you know, in my hands to to take care of the narrative, to take care of um, you know what my career has has been. Um, and I was just happy to I'm, I'm I was just happy to perform and give my team you know solid innings to for them to be in the game and. Obviously, our offense uh, broke out early, <clears throat> um, and that's kind of all we needed for for this game. But um, you know, it's 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 great to be in this position. One last one for Nestor. Uh, we'll finish up with Laura. Kind of jumping off on that, uh, when Boone was in here, he said that when he saw you coming out of the bullpen years ago and even in a mop-up role, you already showed that you had that mentality to compete in these big situations. Do you think those most more difficult years prepared you for a situation like this, or is that something you always had? Um, I think I've always had that fight in me. Um, obviously, you know, what happened in 19, uh, it's hard to say. I mean, I, I, I was trying to find a place in my, in, in my career in, in this team. Um, I probably had probably tried to show more than what I can really do. Um, put me behind the eight ball for a few years. Um, but I was lucky enough for the, for the, you know, the organization and the Yankees to believe in me to bring me back in 21. Um, and from there on, everything just jump started to to what I've been doing today. And like I said, I've, I'm grateful for the opportunity they gave me. I'm grateful for everybody in the front office and, you know, uh, coaches and, I mean, you, down the line, um, for the opportunity to 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 believe in me. And and you know, I'm I'm glad I, I was able to show it today. Nestor, congratulations.